Hi, I'm Katie Kemper, and this is uh, Sly Fox Fabrics. We're here with our um, weekly new stocking fabric reveal, and I'm just going to chat for a few minutes until people hop on. Actually, I'm going to pull this up on my phone. Oh, Mary Beth wants me to tell you about my blog post while I'm chatting. So I started a blog, um, and I put I put my first installment up yesterday on the website, and um, it's called Confessions of a Reluctant Sewist. So if you read the blog, you'll see why I'm a reluctant sewist. <laughs> um, let's see, what else can we talk about? So we have New Brush Poly uh, today, which I'll show you. and. Um, of course, we have the Reveal Booty Giveaway. So every week, if you comment on the video, um, you've you've just made an entry to win the Reveal Booty, which is uh, the fabric, the new stocking fabrics that I show. So today we have five of them. Um, so uh, you can comment as many times as you like. Every comment is an entry, and um, it'll close at four o'clock tomorrow and the winner will be announced around 4.30. And then, um, oh yeah, I do have a note on here to talk about my blog. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. Oh, also, Love Notions is on a, um, they have a goal to hit 30K, and I know that Tammy, the owner, wanted to um, try and hit that by, I think it was this weekend. Friday Is that right? Friday or Saturday. Yeah. Friday or Saturday. So if you're not a part of their group, go and join their group. She's got a ton of wonderful patterns. And uh, it's, a, it's a great group, very active, very um, helpful. So uh, I, I think she has, she has stuff for w women, men, and children, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. she's She's got all the patterns. So um, go check them out. Just if you've never heard of them, which I find that hard to believe, <laughs> just search Love Notions. Um, I think it's called Love Notions Pattern Support Group. Um, oh, also, uh, the Virginia Tank and Maxi Dress came out today or yesterday. I think it was yesterday by five out of four patterns. And um, that's just 5004, my little note on there. That's the, an abbreviation. But if you type in the number 5 and spell out the word out of the number 4.com, that's their website. Go check out the Virginia Tank and Maxi. It's really cute. Um, and there's tons of options, too. And if you're not signed up for our email, sign up for our email because every Wednesday uh, we send out an email with our new stocking fabrics and we show you a bunch of pictures of some of the fabrics that people have made and there is a picture in there of Laura O'Neill in her uh, Virginia tank and maxi dress and it's really cute. You got to check it out. So sign up for our emails. Just go to slyfoxfabrics.com and the sign up is at the bottom of the page um, to get those. And okay, I think we'll go ahead and get started. Oops. I'm playing with that oh, all day. Wants to know what you're wearing. Oh, what am I wearing? This is my crooked top. Check it out. <laughs> this is always, I figured this out. I think it's tighter on one. Here's where my oh, the things are. Oh. So I, I spend all day doing this. Um, this is Rand Shally. It's our Eagles and Arrows. It's um, looks, maybe looks black, but it's navy blue. And it's, uh, what top is this? We can't remember. I, I can't read. I can't remember which top this is. I know I've worn it for the reveal before, but I'll stand up so Sarah you can Maddox see will it. Tell them. Sarah will remember. Sarah Maddox, just watch for her comment if she's watching. She'll remember. Um, I love this top. It is one of my favorite tops. <laughs> Too bad you have no memory. I, yeah, I'm so sorry. I, don't, I can't remember anything. But Mary Beth made it, and she's sitting next to me, and she can't remember either. So. I'm old. I don't have to remember. <laughs> Okay, um, all right, so our first fabric, if I can get back on track here, is, you'll notice a theme this week, and I'm going to tell you that Sarah named all these fabrics, and I think she did a fabulous job, because I love these names. Um, the first one is uh, French Quarter, and it's this gorgeous scroll design.
And there's a couple ways I think you can place the pattern on your um, on your make. So oh, I'm gonna go this way. There's there's a repeating pattern, but it's really quite interesting. So with this one, you have a lot of options. Um, your stretch, nice and stretchy, and all the stretch percentages are on the website. And I'll show you some coordinates. This is gorgeous. And I got really tired of messing with the lights, so I positioned myself so the sunlight, if there was any, could come in. But we're in Northeast Ohio, so it's like being in London. Um, of course it matches black, of course. Uh, ivory, so the white color in here is actually ivory. If I can. And our new mustard gold is a great match. Look how pretty that is together. It's really pretty. Mary Beth's over here off camera. She's my Ed McMahon, so she just is a little camera shy. Okay, so that is French Quarter. I, mean, I like it with these earrings. Check it out. That's cute. Very cute. My little tassel earrings. Okay, our next one is, wait for it, Bourbon Street. Sarah was feeling all New Orleans-ish when she named these, but I think they're perfect names. Double brush poly, of course. This is the chains. And every time, I swear, every time I pick this up, I hear Aretha Franklin singing to me, <laughs> Jane, Jane, Jane. Jane. So, <laughs> um, of course, our mustard gold, again, is a beautiful match. And absolutely black. Black always matches black, in case you were ever wondering. So those are the two coordinates here. And I just want you to know that Mary Beth, she is the one who told, who picked this fabric out. And she's like, oh my gosh. Yeah, tell them how much you didn't want to buy it. <laughs> we have to get this fabric. I said, that takes me back to 19, you know, 90 something. Golden Girls. The Golden Girls. you said. No, I didn't say Golden Girls. I would never say that. <laughs> no, but I, the pictures I've seen of this, I love everything that everybody has made in it. So I totally stand corrected. But yeah. I still don't like distressed fabric. I'm just going to tell you that. Mainly because I bump into doors and I always rip everything. This is Jazz Town. In our last installment in the New Orleans Double Brush Polys. <laughs> At least for today or until Sarah comes back and starts naming again. This is, um, I love this one. It is so cute. And I think Sarah made... Um, that Love Notion skirt out of this. I know she had it cut out, but I haven't been on the page today to check and see if she posted it. So I can't wait to see it. Do you remember what the name of that skirt is? The new Love Notions Maxi skirt? Yeah. No. <laughs> no, but it's really cute. <laughs> We're a lot of help over here. Okay, so coordinates for this one. Now, the white color in here is white, and it matches white. Uh, if you, you know, wanted to match them. Of course, black. Of course and red. And we have two reds, and this is the red. We have red and lipstick red. Lipstick red is a little bit darker. This is the regular red. Um, yeah, it is. <laughs> I just want to double check. So those are your coordinates. And I know some of you might look at that and say, well, does the khaki match it? Does the almond match it? Because of this, you know, pretty um, tan color in here, uh, but they don't. So that's why they're not showing as matches. So there it is. That's Jazz Town. And oh, Love Notions Ravinia skirt. Oh, is the one. Love Notions Ravinia skirt. That's the one Thank I was you. talking about. All right. So we did a poll in the group last week and we asked what fabrics and, you know, fabric types and also fabric prints and colors and things like that. Um, you guys were looking forward to working with this fall, and a lot of you said, I'll get plaid double brush poly. So, and it's not like we ran out and got it. <laughs> we, we had it waiting to, to uh, stock today, but I am happy to report that we have a ton of plaid double brush polys coming soon um, to, you know, sit next to this one on the, on the racks. But 
I love this one. I, I just, I love it. I have no idea what to make out of it, but we did have a couple of makes and they're so cool. One of them is the uh, Georgian ginger um, riot skirt. So cute in this. And the other one is, and that was Sarah Marie made that. I'm sure she's posted it on the page. And the other one is uh, Stephanie Baldwin made a cute t-shirt. And this will be in the email that goes out if you're signed up. It's the uh, Micah t-shirt from Layla Jane, which is a free pattern if you sign up for their emails. So I can't even tell you how cute it is. And I, I want to make a maxi out of this, but it's cute. I don't know what that would look like. I don't, I just don't know on me. My year and mother's butt. <laughs> I actually have my own butt sitting <laughs> on it right now. Um, so here's your, here's your coordinates. Red. And it's so funny because I sat down to do these fabrics this week and every fabric coordinates black with the same colors. <laughs> um, and this is, yeah, this is white. It's not ivory. It won't match ivory. It matches white. I really like the white with that. Mm -hmm, really. And crispy. this color is not in this fabric, but because it's a plaid, you have the white and the black over each other here. Your charcoal looks really nice with it. Um, and then also light gray is really pretty with it. So you could match those up. Um, and they're great coordinates. So. So somebody is saying that she wishes she had closed caption because her kids are sleeping. If she can't get it there, let her know that she can yeah. do that. Yeah, somebody is watching and wants closed caption and because her kids are sleeping. So uh, the good news is we don't have it here on Facebook, but when I post this video to YouTube, which I do right after it downloads, um, after we go off air, you can turn closed captioning on uh, on YouTube. And it's, it's a pretty good closed captioning. Mm -hmm. So for anybody who needs closed captioning, um, oh. that is one of the reasons we went on YouTube. Somebody also suggested this would make a really cute button-up flannel looking shirt. Yes. Somebody suggested that this flannel would make a really cute button-up flannel shirt. And I totally agree. And um, I had a little mental note to go look for a pattern. I've never done buttons before. So that's, yeah, okay. everybody complains about buttons, so I'm not looking forward to that idea. But I was thinking maybe I could find something that doesn't have buttons. You could sew buttons on the front and put a snap on the back. It would look like <laughs> you, a could sew you could sew buttons. buttons on the front and put a snap on the back. Hi, my name is Katie. I don't know how to use buttons. <laughs> <laughs> um, this next one is Azteca in gold. We, had as, we have it in another colorway as well. Rose, I think. It's very pretty. This one is very earthy. Um, I think it's beautiful. So the only thing is, I thought, oh, it's definitely going to match gold. It doesn't match gold, so it doesn't match. Ivory, of course. So the white on this is ivory, and um, and black. Those are your <clears throat> coordinates for this one. Ivory and black. I tried to match it up to every tannish, brownish color that we have, and no, it doesn't match. If believe it or not. Believe it or not. I mean, look behind me. I've got like a hundred solids, and believe it or not, it doesn't match any of them. So, except for the um, the ivory and the and the black. So, this is our last brush poly for today. Okay, your top is the Bianca by Made by Ray. Oh, okay. My top is the Bianca by Made by Ray. Yeah. And thank you to Sarah and Beth. And thank you, Sarah and Beth. They're, they're the ones that figured it out and remembered. Okay. So I'm trying to think if there's anything else. That was our last fabric. We don't have any other news. Can't think of anything. Anything else to declare? We have nothing to declare. Yeah, okay, so um, I think that's it. Hop over to Love Notions, join their group, help them meet their goals. Plus, they're having giveaways, I'm pretty sure. Isn't she having giveaways? She's having a sale, a big sale. Oh, she's having a big sale. 30% off. 30% off. Go to her page. That's a, that's a really good sale, 30% mm -hmm. off. 
Um, okay. So that's it. That's it. That's it for today. We will see you next Wednesday, same time, same place. Thank you for joining us. Comments, you can uh, enter to win the Reveal Booty. <laughs> All right, we'll see you next week.